It's fine. Don't worry about it. So tell me about how it felt. Well, what happened was when I was drawing this, uh -huh. when I started drawing this one, uh -huh. it started forcing me uh -huh. to do in the same directions. Uh -huh. But I smartly drew something different. Holy shit. Like here, uh -huh. I, my, my starting points were different. Like here, I started with this line, uh -huh. then draw this line, uh -huh. this one. And his, this machine started emulating the same thing. Uh -huh. So it started forcing me to start from here. Uh -huh. I feel kind of uh, trapped. Uh -huh. or like, you know, yeah, definitely. Uh, get a feeling like yeah, it's someone is holding. Yeah, uh, I think I would like to try it one more time. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Maybe I can have some more input on how this I feel like. Yeah, so this time we'll try a circle. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> and the way it forces me, it kind of feels slightly different. Uh -huh. uh, I would not judge it good or bad. But since we are so used to drawing in our own ways, in our own way, yeah. so what is happening is this this movement. Yeah. Every time you have your own judgment with the paper, yeah. with the space, with the shape, with the size, exactly, uh, with the tool, and with the touch. So all those things are lost when I get a force feedback. Mm. Okay, so this was about the way you defined geometry. Hmm. Um, let's. I, we have another thing where um, it's going to be a bit different because the camera is now going to see me. And I was trying to get that. So here, the if you see the lines are going crooked uh -huh. here or here, but at the same time I was trying to understand that, and then I was creating the lips in such a way. And then it did something here. And it feels magical. <laughs> <laughs> 